I'm retired Major General Jim Jackson, the Director of the United States of America Vietnam War Commemoration. On behalf of the commemoration, I'd like to express a heartfelt thank you to all Vietnam veterans and everyone who served on active duty between 1 November 1955 and 15 May 1975 and all of your families. Many of you watching this message have been involved with activities that have publicly and individually recognized these patriots. And thanks to the remarkable dedication of our thousands of commemorative partners, the commemoration has been able to support more than 18,000 events which you have hosted across the country. This effort has inspired Americans to thank and honor 2.6 million Vietnam era veterans and their families. We are excited to carry this momentum into 2020, beginning with the observance of the third anniversary of 29 March, National Vietnam War Veterans Day. This observance offers each of us an opportunity to pause and remember the service and sacrifices of those who served during this war. Additionally, throughout 2020, we will continue to ask our partners to help us as we continue to focus efforts on reaching Vietnam era veterans who may not be able to attend public events, specifically those residing in hospice and long-term care facilities. Reaching these hard to find veterans and families is especially important since the Department of Veterans Affairs estimates that we lose more than 500 Vietnam era veterans every day. We need your help to, to locate and honor all of these brave men and women who served and sacrificed and, ex and to extend to them a long overdue thank you before our opportunity vanishes. During this holiday season, I encourage each of you to once again reflect on your blessings and think of those less fortunate. Remember those who are no longer with us, appreciate those still with us, and continue to thank those serving today. For more information about this national commemoration, please visit our website at vietnamwar50th.com. And from all of us to all of you, have a happy holidays.